Hi, gals and guys. It's Chris Mojo from MediaHelper.com. And this time out uh, for a quick tip, I just want to address this 404 error that I'm getting. Uh, very unusual. Uh, nothing, something I never came up against. Um, typically, I know how to correct 404 errors. So if you're ever giving a 404 error because you made any type of changes, uh, just go to your permalinks in your settings and just save again. In most cases, that fixes it. Or you can, uh, there's a file, a FileZilla video in my instructionals if you need it, but uh, you can go to your HT access file and I'll put this down in the description. Uh, let me grab this here. And you can just put this in there and uh, just create a new file for it and then just update the permalinks again and then correct it. Um, so neither of those fixes uh, worked. So it's kind of an unusual thing. Let me show you. Let me show you here. I'll get out of this. I'm gonna go into my posts. I'll posts. And somebody is vacuuming in the background. There. Uh, so this particular, actually, there's a bunch of posts. If you look. Um, the categories are my media helper and portfolio. So if I go here and do a view here, it comes up as category mymediahelper.com or my media helper, I should say. I don't want that. I want it to come up as mymediahelper.com portfolio, Photoshop, and WordPress. So let me show you what happens there. I'm going to go into edit. And then I'm just going to get uh, my media helper out there. I'm going to update. And once that updates, I'll show you exactly what happens. All right, so see, this is how I want it. Portfolio slash Photoshop in the article name. And there's a 404. So interesting enough, uh, see if I want to change it to article. Update it. And see, it says article, so the category would be article. So I can change the category and it will pop up. So that's kind of an unusual problem, why it's not popping up for portfolio, but it will pop up for every other category that I put in. So for instance, let's put in, uh, I don't know, just video essays. It'll come up as video essays. All right, we'll open it. It should pop right up, and there's the article under video essays. So I'm not really sure why it's not um, allowing me to do portfolio. That's kind of crazy. So what I found as a solution was actually very, very easy. It's actually a, a known issue. Um, and the reason I stumbled upon it is I took WooCommerce off uh, as a plugin because I don't need it for this particular website. And if you look back on the video, I had all these uh, category options that I could put in. Uh, once you take WooCommerce off, this is what's left. And so what I did not have in there, these were blank. So what I did not have on, in here was category, the word category or the word tag. It was like that. Um, so what you have to do is put in category, put in tag, and then I just save the changes. And then let me go back to that particular blog post. Uh, I just got to bring it up again. And I'll go to the end. Da, 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 da. Oh, we'll go to the end. And I think it's one over. And there it is right there. So as you can see, it is now under portfolio. If I click on the link, it shows portfolio. So it was a very simple fix, very known issue, not terrible. Um, yeah, but always update your Always update your permalinks. That's always the first step. You can take, you can change your HTM file and um, just create a new one with that. And of course, make sure category and tag is in there, and that uh, fixed all my issues. So very simple, very easy, 
And that's all I got for you today for this quick tip. And I uh, thank you as always. And please, if this was helpful or any of my videos helpful, please subscribe. Uh, please share. Please like. Like is the thumb up. And uh, certainly hit the bell below so you can see any updates and uh, more videos to come. And I uh, thank you very much. And I'll talk to you later.